Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Today we're going to be taking a look at Adware Antivirus. I'm going to be showing you how to install this free antivirus program and we'll take a look at how good this program actually is. To start off with you need to head on over to the link that's in the description below and you'll end up on a page that looks like this. Once you're on this page you need to press get adware antivirus free and we need to press this download button above the free text. Once you've done that you now need to wait for this file window to pop up and press save file. Once that's done, you now need to run the installer and you now need to press start install. Once Adware Antivirus is finished installing, we can now reboot our machine and then load up the program. Once your computer's restarted, you'll be greeted with a thank you for installing window, as you can see here. If you've got an activation key, you can now enter it in by clicking it on this button. Or if you want to register for the free version, we can just press this button now. And we can press register. All you need to do is type in your first name, your last name and your email address. Once you have entered in your details and opened up your emails and got your activation key, you should end up with a window like this that says activation key accepted. You can now press close this window. And we can now press get the latest definition files. Once Adware has finished updating, you can now press close. And this is what the program looks like. This is the main interface. It does look a bit old and standard. Don't really have no oomph to it. But overall, it's still nice. You know, you've got to give it that. As you can see here, we've got real time protection on. If you want web protection, then you do need to upgrade. That's also the same for email protection and network protection. Let's just go along the left here and see what options we got. We can scan our computer. We can do a quick scan, a full scan or a custom scan. Also, we got automated scan, which is on. If we carry on scrolling down, there's a few other options. If we go down now, we've got our real-time protection, which is on, and that's standard. I don't think there's a gaming option in, in here, which means, obviously, when you launch a game, normally antivirus programs and that, they turn their real-time protection into kind of a less resource use kind of mode. So you've got more RAM and CPU usage for your games. If we go down again, we got our email protection, but you do need to upgrade for that, unfortunately. And that was the same for the network. We got our app management here. We can change our key if we want, which is there. Oh, there you go. There is a gaming mode. As you can see, it's currently off. I'm just going to tick that to on now because I do like to play a lot of games on my computer. If we go down again, we've got our notification center and we got our help center. And that is pretty much for Ad Aware. It is it is a good program. Um, obviously, any program's good, really, if it's free, to be honest. I will do a massive video on all the antivirus programs at some point, seeing which one is the best. We will put them all to the test. I will download some viruses and we'll see which ones can detect the viruses and which ones can't. I hope this video helped. If it did, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.